Please don't break. Please. Oh, yes! It's working! Hello guys and welcome back to another video of Julia. In today's video, I thought to myself, what on earth am I going to do? However, I have an idea. And I have decided that because of the new create mod items, such as the ginormous water wheel, if I can place it down, there you go, the big ginormous water wheel, I decided that I wanted to build a boat. One of those steamboats, the uh, the ones you see on the rivers uh, of, uh, was it Los Angeles? I can't remember. Uh, but they are like big steamboats and they have these big paddle wheels on the side and I decided I want to build that. And then I found this island and then I figured I want to build this around this island. So that is what we are going to do in today's video. Build a steamboat and make it go around an island. So, obviously, uh, back in the day, you used to do this with uh, minecart assemblers, um, here, I saw them, uh, unless they removed them, I did see, here you go, cart assemblers, and you would just pile up a bunch of glass and you would make it go around. Well, basically, I figured we can do the same thing with rails and trains, but I do gotta figure out... I, I want to build the boat first, then I will... Actually, no, I'm gonna put the rails on the ground first. Um, Alright, I'm gonna lay out the track and then I'll get back to you in a minute. Alright, so I have made a track entirely around this island right here. I removed some of the terrain over there because otherwise it would be too tight. However, I marked the center of the track uh, right on this uh, stone pillar. So now we can start uh, designing this ship and I think... Uh, for wood choice, or for the, uh, wood choice, sorry, for the, uh, bottom part of the ship, the hull, I want, obviously, some type of red, so if I look upstairs, mm, red nether brick stairs would work, so red nether bricks, there we go, if we get that selection going, so this is gonna be the front, let's see, um, stairs upside down, hmm, Okay, um, I'll cut back to you when I'm done with the hole, but it won't be too big, but it won't be too small either. So I will be right back when I have finished the hole. Okay, that is the hole of the ship done. Let me get a sponge to remove the water on the inside, see if it's waterproof. Alright, there we go. And yeah, that's all the water out. I have built a rudder, as you can see, and the entire hole. Okay, so next is going to be either white or a line of blackstone like they had on ships such as titanic um let's see how the blackstone looks first so if we just grab some blackstone right here uh actually i like blackstone i like the bricks i think yeah if we just line that all the way around like this Okay, um, no, I don't like that. We're getting rid of that. Okay, we're just gonna go with quartz instead. Um, I chose quartz because I think it is the most whitest block we have. Because we don't have a white wooden uh, block one, and it's the only white block that actually has stuff like stairs. So if I get out my quartz artillery, I am going to use quartz, 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 smooth quartz, quartz, stairs, smooth quartz, every type of quartz. I will use. There we go. Okay. Um, am I gonna do that with smooth? I'm gonna do that with smooth. Yeah, for now. Okay. Um, I think it's a smart idea if I just start building and I will see you guys when I have finished that process. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, and that is a big part of the hole done. And now I actually want to get in the water wheels so that I can get a better picture of what the ship's gonna look like in the big picture. So, that's one wheel on this side and one on the other. I believe uh, there is a type of, yeah, mangrove wood. That's pink. Can we turn that? Yes. Okay, that's cool. Wait, could we, could we use that nether crimson wood? I wonder... We can. Ooh, look better. 
I think I like the uh, this one, the uh, mangrove uh, wood. Okay, so these are going to be our uh, pedal thingies. Um, now I'm going to install the rest of the ship. I am thinking we need a cab in the middle. Um, I want to use dark oak because otherwise our ship is going to be way too white and that is not going to help our situation at all. So I'm going to sketch out a little area here with dark oak and then I will get the port going actually. Yeah. Um, so once I have sketched out something I will be right back with you to check what I have made. Okay, so I have currently built the deck. Um, now I'm planning to uh, get you going through the entire thing. So I'm thinking that obviously the uh, center part of this is going to have to be ports. There's no doubt about it, but the windows, I uh, think we should make those dark oak at the very least. So if I get my ports here, get some pillars, why not make them go from all the way down? Like so. There we go. Build those up. And do we build these too high? I'm gonna I'm gonna do one of those uh, comparing things that I do rather often. I compare the actual uh, sides to each other, think which one looks better. Okay, so we have this side with the singular windows and this side with the let's go over singular windows because otherwise it'll be too tall. Then get the quartz in there. Uh, next, I'm going to have to build a tiny sort of captain's hut, but before I do that, I am going to. Ooh, actually, hang on. I like that idea. But the front has a little peeking over thing. Yes, definitely. And then around the back, we are going to have to build a chimney, which were mostly red or were yellow. I'm thinking red, so that is Crimsite. It's all the color of red. I'll give it a go though. I like to experiment with many things. And then obviously Blackstone for the top part of the chimney because it has always been like that. Let me get it. Where's the walls? There they are. Okay. If we get this out and maybe like this. Will that it looks a bit Mm, it looks like it's broken its back. Ooh, that doesn't look right at all. Okay, never mind. Um, this, how does this look? What? That isn't actually too bad. How about this? Nope, definitely not. I think the black's too big. I like the one slab on top instead. Yeah, I, I prefer that over it. Okay, so. We... If I place this behind there, will that work? Yes, that will work. Okay, so we have our boat. Um, I think we're missing the masts at the front, or what do you call those? I think it's a mast, right? Hang on. It's it's easy to place, just get some fences. Uh, up. Oh. And then just build it all the way up to the top. Is that high enough? Yeah, that's high enough. And then one over here as well. And then on the front mast, you obviously need one of those decks. So that will be easily made with trapdoors that we can place like so. A lot of detailing things go through my mind when I'm making these things. So yeah, that is way too high up now that I've looked at it properly. And then they have a bell at the top. There we go. And then I'm going to just put one on top for good measure. All right. Yeah, that's our boat done. Okay, so now I'm just gonna have to glue this all together. Um, okay. 
yeah, one moment. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, then everything should now be glued together. So, where I am going to make the uh, areas of the glass that will be connected is going to be at both poles. So, we have to go all the way down to the tracks, right here. Or all the way down, depending on what type of thing you're doing. Okay, I just need to glue this together. Right to the bottom one. Like this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch out all the sides, otherwise you will see the glass moving, and that would be kind of weird. Uh, right, that's the first pulse, and now the second one will be under here. Problem. Why can't we... I'm just going to close this up for now so the water doesn't get in the way. Okay. Now we just fill that in with glass. All the way down. Again. There we go, there we go. Okay, the issue's now been solved. There was a tiny problem down there with the, uh the part being one too far to the left so I had to adjust it uh, one back so it's not actually connected to the pole it's one to the right but um, we are going to need some controls which I wanted to put up here so if I just get a quick slab real quick uh, right let's get you going there and then a ladder so we can get up here Ooh, let's make a brass ladder I like that there we go all the way up now we just need some train controls and we need a seat make it a red seat and also um i hope this works actually this should work no it should just work so we have our train controls right there our boat is ready and all i have to do now is go down and see if it works now everything should be okay oh god okay let's try this one last time before everything goes up into dust okay oh Ooh. Did it work? I think it did not. Where did it go wrong? These are attached, but these aren't. Um, hang on, I'll be right back. Okay. Hang on, I'm stuck. One moment. There we go. Let's try it again. One last time. Please don't break. <gasps> yes! It's working! We have a moving boat. We have a moving boat. And it's working. And it's not breaking. It's perfect. It works. It functions. I have built an actual steam boat without it failing. At least, failed a few times, but it works now. I, I love this. This looks amazing. And apart from the little issues we had in the beginning, it actually is a working boat. I wonder what this looks like at full speed, though. Oh, oh, I killed a zombie. It must have been in the cave. Ooh, this looks really weird. Do you think we can reach max speed? I think on this part of the line, maybe. Come on. Yes. Ooh. Okay. So, yeah, we have uh, we have our boat, and it works. It sails. It actually functions. And I all thought this because of the water wheels, and I love the fact that the water wheels work perfectly with this boat because it makes it look like an actual steam paddle boat. But yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. And I'm just going to park it here really quickly, and I'm just going to get out, and I'm just going to go on deck. Um, and yeah. Oh, there's an issue right there, but ha, it's symmetry. I'll fix that sooner or later. But um, yeah, I hope you guys definitely enjoyed this video as much as I did creating it. And I will see you guys in the next video that we upload. Have a good day, everyone. Goodbye. See you. Bye-bye.